I have a couple journals ready that I would like to show you today. They have uh, fabric covers. Uh, the covers have a tea theme. One has a teapot. These have tea cups and saucers. I've been making some fabric covers lately. I've kind of enjoyed doing a couple little different things again. This one is the fabrics are know, almost like quilted together. And then that's the inside of that one. And I have this one too. So probably be making a couple more of these yet. It has a different fabric on the inside. Very fun. So I'll start with, uh, I think we'll start with this. This journal has a sheer closure flower embellishment, a little lace on the closure, has some birds hand stitched on and some butterflies and some beads and some lace, lace on the edge. There's one sewn in signature and just some lace scattered throughout. I think this was a, started out as a, placemat and I took it apart and took took some of the batting out. It was kind of thick and put some fabric on the inside and then sewed them together and had a freeform foot that I got. So I did a lot of freeform stitching to so it gives it kind of a really nice feel. So we'll go inside and check out the inside. Because it's not it's not a book cover or anything with cardboard or anything, so it's just fabric. <clears throat> it has a pocket on the inside cover, it's an old linen, some stitching on it. I didn't do the stitching. It says a book page pocket, gessoed and painted over the words so you can write on it. And then a large recipe card. So they tuck in there. I had different stationary pages and different size papers, so I used a lot of different sizes. There's a ticket in there, tuck spot up here, lace pocket with a journal card inside with a little bow, fabric pocket with another tea card. It just has an image printed on, tuck spot. This is a journal card out of one of my Etsy sheets in my printable sheets in my Etsy store. And this is a little tag with some fabric and printing on. Tucks in that pocket there. Little tuck spot up here. Some lace on the edge. Another old book page pocket with a little card in with a teapot. Fabric pocket with another little journal spot tucked inside. Has some fringes. Ayazie, when I ordered a couple of little journals, she sent me some little packs that had some cute papers and things in. So this is one of them. It's kind of pretty. It has a little shimmer to it. It says a little fabric tuck spot. Their tag. This is cardstock tag. This is one of the pages I like. I like to kind of create some pages for my journals digitally, so that's one of them. There's a little fabric on the side of that page. This is a notebook page with some tissue paper decoupaged on with a pocket and journal card. Sewn around the edges, lace pocket. This is a one of the fabric teapots from the the fabric from the cover. It's a tracing paper pocket. Another journal card tucked in there. It's a little linen and lace tab with a little bead closure and some lace or ble <laughs> a bead dangle. This page flips up. So that creates a nice area for writing. This has a <clears throat> page inside. Stamping. This says vintage Christmas, but it kind of matched in here really well, so I tucked it in there. This is a decoupaged image napkin on the page. A little embellishment, a little dangle, and this is an embellished paper clip with some fabric strips. This is a muslin stamped. It's a little, you can tuck things underneath it. It's like a little banner. You can hang things up. But this is just a music sheet folded in half. 
think that came from my Azier too. It says a little journal card with a, another little tuck spot underneath the image. Tucks underneath these doilies in the tuck spot there. There's another one on this side and has some little tickets paper fastened together. Just canes in that little pocket. Some of the journal page in here. Some silverware printed on. Pocket. This is another decoupage image. Another pocket. Sewn around the edges. There's some stamping. And this this too, you can tuck a picture in here. This is a page uh, Nick the Booksmith taught us how to make pages from our scraps. So I followed along and made a couple of pages. Uh, I really like that technique. So thanks a lot, Nick. It was very fun. I made a lace pocket on there with a journal card and a tab. And this is just a fold-out image. Some sewing on some of the pages, another pocket. There's a tuck spot underneath the stamp there. And this has a muslin pocket in it too. And that's a tuck spot. So that goes in there. Little lace and linen tab. This is another image from my printable sheet in my Etsy store. And this is pocket is embellished with some lace and ribbon. This is decoupaged on. She's got a little fabric bow tied on there. This is another page with a journal page sewn around the edges. It's a copy filter with a banner with an image tucked inside on both sides. And it says True Friend stamped on the linen. It's the middle of the signature. This flips out, sewn on Lace is sewn on there, a little embellishment there. It's just kind. It's with another copy filter, journal card. It's another one with the paper fastened, little two, two tickets together. This is a pocket inside for holding photos, letters, receipts. Another pocket. The page. It's the other side of that page that I sewed together, and I put some uh, flowers inside the tissue paper, made or tracing paper, made a pocket for this tag. So that kind of slides in there. And I put some beads on the strings, so they're kind of always just you know flopping around wherever when you use your journal. It's kind of neat. It's a little lace tab up in this page with some more stamping and some fabric ruffled on the edge of this page. A little flower on that page corner and some things glued on this the other half of the book page with the tissue paper. It has a couple pockets and a journal card. This is a fabric pocket. It's a cardstock pocket. It's the other side of the design paper. Stationary fabric on the edge or trim, I should say, and this flips open for writing. Nice journal card tucked in here. It's another tag in this pocket with some lace. Another pocket and some fabric and embellishments. Another pocket with this Tiffany and Company stamped image on there, and a nice big journal card that says friendship on in the back pocket. So that is the first journal. And I think what I'll probably do is uh, maybe I'll do a second video for the other journal so that the videos don't get too long. So this journal will be, you can find the link below as to if you're interested in purchasing it. Thank you for watching.